Uh, oh, she was still there. Eight years ago. They had some articles in Albuquerque News about him. Dwayne Stitzinger couldn't have been more proud of his 25-year-old son, Andrew. That's his three buddies right there he went to war with. He was proudly serving our country in Baghdad. But then he got the worst call possible. And of course, Andrew, you know him. He had to drive that Hummer. <laughs> and uh, he hit the wrong thing in the road. And it blew him up. Andrew lost part of his leg, an eye, a finger, and had severe head trauma. Doctors were able to bring him home alive, but Dwayne was only able to spend one more Christmas with his son. A couple months later, he went to sleep. That was it. He never woke up. The two used to go fishing growing up, but not alone, with Andrew's best pal, their dog, Babe. He couldn't wait to see Babe. Babe was his favorite dog. So Dwayne took Babe fishing every week in that year after Andrew died. And Babe would go with him every Memorial Day to visit Andrew's grave. But she was by my side 24-7 to help me with this terrible thing that happened. How you doing, sweetheart? This year, Babe turned 17 years old. She's in really, uh, really bad shape. And Dwayne knew she might not make it to Memorial Day this year. Babe, she, she went to work with me every day. She was by my side. She was one of the best support dogs you could ever have and then just lost her two, two weeks ago. The Awatuki community paying for Babe to be cremated. Dwayne still keeping her right next to him because even though he isn't able to hug her tight on this day this year, he knows somebody who is, Andrew. Hard Memorial Day without him, my other supporter around. Yeah, but at least, at least they're reunited. Yeah. And uh, I don't know how I got through it. Babe. In Ahwatukee, Brianna Whitney for Arizona's Family.